Tears fall for a reason, and they are your strength, not weakness. I think you believe in me more than I do, said the boy. You'll catch up. So again, he's got a little bit of mental there. Life is difficult, but you are loved. So again, you know, this thing we talk about, guys, you know, this sort of stuff can sort of hit, oh, you know, that loved piece. So again, but you are, there's someone out there. Look, lights, that's like a home. Yes, it does, doesn't it, said the mole. So he's looking for his home. The fox never really speaks, whispered the boy. No, and it's lovely he is with us, said the horse. So they're falling together. So the fox isn't saying a lot. To be honest, I often, this is the fox saying this, by the way. To be honest, I often feel I have nothing interesting to say, said the fox. Being honest is always interesting, said the horse. What's the bravest thing you've ever said, asked the boy. Help, said the horse. I'm going to stop there. I like that. That's a good point to stop. Go on. You just, can... I just think I meant to watch the, the asking for help. You know that acknowledgement that it is, it can be a challenge for people, and it is if you find it easy or if you find it difficult, it is a brave thing to do because it's building on the vulnerability piece. You're putting yourself out there, aren't you? And I think it's but... important for people to know that and that it's okay to do it, and you know, acknowledge that it does take courage to do it. So, to right, I think a lot of times we don't want to ask for help, do we? Because you want to think, well, I want to be able to work this out myself. And again, I think it's, you know, and I think, you know, whoever's watching, whether, you know, whatever gender you are, I think, you know, sometimes we, you know, we find it difficult to ask for that help. And I just, and again, going back to mental health thing again, I found it really difficult to ask for help. Um, I didn't want to say to my leader that I'm struggling. And then it all came out. I had to say something that I had to, I had to go home. I had to get help. I had to go and see the doctor, but I didn't want to do it. What would have been the ramification if I didn't do it? You know, and that for me, you know, when he says that whole thing about that help piece, you know, that's the bravest thing to do. That for me, we took a lot of courage to be able to be up front where I'd never talked about it before, I, you know, all self-talk and then it came out. So asking for help is a massive strength. But you, again, it comes back to that vulnerability to be vulnerability piece, to be honest with yourself when you need the help and when you are honest with yourself and go, do you know what? I want to do this myself, but I can't, you know, I'm not saying I can't, but I'm struggling. I need some help, you know, because I don't, I don't like to use the word can't because I think we can, but we need some help along the way. And I think yeah. that's where there's important pieces there. <laughs>